Okay, so to make a small resume of uh, my first uh, two weeks in Mexico, I've enjoyed a lot. I spent way too long uh, time in uh, Playa de Carmen. I met a lot of uh, nice people that kind of uh, trapped me there and I was having a way too good time that's why i didn't leave for more than a week i've done a lot of activities around playa de carmen there are loads of cenotes there are lots of excursions to do and you can do a lot of them without a tour so just get a colectivo pay at the pay to the driver and go wherever there is something to see and explore it by yourself then i also went to bacalar um, it's a really nice place and not yet spoiled, a bit posh, a bit on the posh side. Uh, then uh, Valladolid and Merida as for another big cities. Valladolid, well maybe it has like two main streets you can spend there half a day and kind of like see uh, the city itself and um, it also has some uh, cenotes around I haven't seen those as I have been to many of them in the uh, Playa de Carmen and Tulum areas then as for Merida it's a cultural uh, city for of Central uh, America and there is a lot, a lot, of, a lot of culture. There is a lot of things to see. There is a lot of events to participate. And from Merida, you can do like uh, day excursions to Uxmal to see the ruins and to Celestum, where you can see uh, the flamingos, uh, which is much less touristy than Rio, uh, than Rio Lagartos and Las Coloradas, which you normally do on trips from Cancun. Uh, then Holbox, a magnificent, beautiful beach uh, with way too many mosquitoes, uh, but still um, with uh, beautiful stuff to see and experience. And now we are in Isla Mujeres, uh, which is very crowded, has very nice places, but to my taste, it's a little bit too many people and a little bit too many shouts here and there as you can probably hear and see what's going around me enjoy